Everybody's looking for that something. One. Michael is signing up for some blind dates. With, yeah. With Harriet leading the, the, the idea, is that right? Yeah. And Harriet is quite literally at the front of the queue. Now Harriet's normally asking you about a lady at work. She's not here, so I might step into her shoes. No, they wouldn't fit that. They wouldn't fit it. How's it going with this lady at work, Michael? Uh, Non-existent, mate. You're being chased. Non-existent. Non-existent. Another girl at work texting you, like, in ridiculous times, like, 8 o'clock at night. The only problem is, she's one of the inmates. Well, he's tucked up in bed, yeah. No, no, mate. About half 11, she phones, texts me, just want to know what I'm doing. I'm sleeping. I've got to get up in the morning. I'm sleeping. He's in... <clears throat> Cotton. I have a question. If you're sleeping, how are you texting her back? I'm not then texting her back. He's been woken up, isn't he? Ah. I've got to see. I've set my alarm on my phone. So where's this? Where's this relationship going? That's what I think all the parents out there are thinking right now. Mm, nowhere. Nowhere. It's uh, 25 to life, isn't she? It's come to a full stop. <laughs> <laughs> I'm only a young person. She's. Uh, OAP. Uh, yes. I was going to say senior citizen. Yeah. Very short-sighted one at that. I love this background music. He's okay, any other news in your life at the moment? What what kind of things do you do outside of work? Uh, here? Yeah. Wednesday night. Okay. Being tormented by the Thursday night crew. Yeah. We're just bringing, spreading the love. We're bringing that Thursday night vibe to a Wednesday. Mm -hmm. Spreading the love, Matt. She's still videoing as well. I know. Put it away, Michael, put it away. I'm not going to tell. Cause they're missing You've got to find